All right. I want you to just tell the devil something today. We're always talking to one another. But I want you to kind of ball up your fists and send him a 1999 message. Tell him, Satan, Satan you, can't you can't stop me. You can't stop me. Because my mind is made up. Did you just say that because I told you to say it? Now, if that's really what your spirit is saying, then you're determined that whatever situation you left in the classroom, whatever situation you left on your job, whatever situation you left at home, and whatever thing that is that's tugging at you mentally, you're going to tell the devil, you can't stop me. I'm determined. I'm going forward. I'll be victorious because my mind is made up. Amen. Word of Word of God lets you know that as you think in your heart, amen, that, that's what determines when you purpose in your heart, and when you're determined, God will let you come through even when the odds seem like everything is stacked against you. The odds are insurmountable, but you're going to make it. Let this mind be in you that was where? Also in Christ Jesus. Don't you know that every demon in hell set out to stop him from reaching his goal? <laughs> but it didn't matter what the devil threw at him. He made it because his mind was made up. Look at what Nehemiah says in verse 20. Then answered I them and said unto them, the God of heaven will prosper us. Hmm? This is what you got to get in your mind. I don't care how many critics are trying to block me and trying to stop me. My mind is made up. And, and I'm not depending on the critic to help push me over. I, I'm not depending on, on the devil to get in the parade and celebrate. I'm not depending on those who don't know my God. The one I'm depending on is the God of heaven. And because I'm depending on him, he'll make me prosper even if I don't have enough money. He'll make me prosper when they're talking about find me on the job. He'll make me prosper Anybody in here got your mind made up? Yeah. It's a new year. New challenges. But don't let the devil make you doubt. To prosper means to succeed, to thrive, to go forward in victory. And I don't care what 1999 holds. I know victory is mine. I know prosperity and success are mine. Not because of anything I have or anything that I know other than the God that I know. And he says, the God of heaven. Don't worry about Geshem. Don't worry about Sanballat. Don't worry about Tobias. I don't know who the enemy is that's trying to block you from succeeding in what you're trying to do in life. Glory to God. And don't you dare tell nobody who that enemy is. But you can just hold that name in your mind and just say, I'm not worried about mm -hmm. the God of heaven. He's going to make me prosper. <laughs> I 
We even took a glance back at the life of Joseph this morning. And when you read about Joseph, after his brother sold him and the slavery in Egypt, I told y'all, as much as I'm trying, that long wind the spirit is all over me today. <laughs> Joseph got sold into slavery, but the Bible said that as a slave in the house of an Egyptian, that God caused everything he did to prosper. And I kept on reading in that same chapter after he got put in prison, the keeper of the prison turned everything over to Joseph. And the Bible says again, even in prison, God calls Joseph to prosper. Now you are not a slave and you are not in prison. What's your trouble? If Joseph could prosper as a slave, and prosper in prison. And here you are, not a slave and not in prison. The only prison that you are in is the prison of your mind. Make up your mind that I'm going to prosper. Anybody got your mind made up? I see stumbling blocks in front of me, but my mind is made up. The enemy is all around me, but my mind is made up. Critics on every corner, but my mind is made up. Sometimes, look like my thoughts don't come together like they ought to around this matter facing me, but I know for myself, 